Uh, hello there, you beautiful dreamers. Welcome back to Let's Play Yumituki episode 173. Coming to you with a new version of the game, of course, because it has been ever so long since we've checked in on old Uro. So, I knew I said Mado there. Getting my dreamers all mixed up. Um, what are we going to do today? we got some interesting little things to look at. There's a, well, I think it's a bunch of new stuff to look at, but um, there's a particular few things that I want to... Uh, try and get over today. Things which I think are quite neat, um, which involve going to some areas we've not we've not been to in what feels like an eternity. What about this world, eh? Do you remember this world? There's like I can't even remember the last time we've been here. I'd say years easily. I think it was to visit that um, that cool statue thing. That lets you see where they see what the effects are up to, but. We're not playing with that. As fun as that is, that's not what we're here for. Um, what we might be here for is a bunch of navigation failure. Um, but, you know, that's, that's par for the course, isn't it? Um, I hope everybody's happy. Everybody's doing well and isn't too, you know, jonesing for a, a tookie hit. I do apologise that it's been such a such a big break um, between episodes. Ah, good. Good. What's this, eh? It's like a curvy thing with a weird pink set of teeth. No, it's a curtain, Dreamers. Just tasted this lovely little area. Just nice and peaceful, isn't it? It's full of stars. It's got a nice aesthetic to it. It's nice. Music's perhaps a little bit a little bit high. I mean, I've I've obviously got my sound volume quite low because I know what this game's like. But all the same, it's quite peaceful, isn't it? Got some wee flashing buttons. Moon suspended by some string. We saw a moon suspended by. Well, I don't think it was suspended by string. Um, not long ago. I don't really think there's a huge amount to look at in here, other than just soaking up the nice atmosphere. There's a big uh, bar soap shaped cloud. I'm sure we've all seen one of those. Uh, let's go in here. So this takes you into this interesting little passage here, um, which you can you can run around in should you choose to. But there's uh, there's not a lot happening really, other than some sort of ominous music. But there are these segments floating. And what you can do, of course, Dreamers, is you can get your old lantern out. Get in use of the effects, who would have thought? Um, don't know what they're supposed to be. They kind of look like they could be nasty orange segments to me. Or perhaps some uh, continental breakfasts suspended in the air. So I really like them, you know, suspended in the air. You got eat it like I don't know, I was going to say a piñata, but I don't think you eat a piñata when it's like dangling around, you're supposed to beat it up, which I think I think uh, Uro would be all over, personally. They change colour. They also, some of them wiggle around a lot. Got a live one, no, not so live one. So, we're going to just walk and see if we can't enjoy some of these for a little while. It's nice. Maybe something's going to happen. It's extremely warm um, where we're recording again, so uh, there's potential that we could have, you know, outside influence set to interrupt the stream, i.e. the window's open, dreamers. The dream window is open, and who knows what, you know, miscellaneous dreamers could just stumble on in and be like, ah, there's my friend Uro. Yeah, we go way back. Imagine that, dreamers. Imagine bumping into a fan of Yumi Tuki randomly within your own home just like there they are there was a sort of a shift there just i don't know if anyone caught that there it kind of jolted um i don't really know what the conditions are for um what's happening here so i'm just gonna walk left arbitrarily until i get bored and then uh, we'll, we'll find something else to do see it happened again there happened again mm, that's my favorite that one sunburnt Maybe it happens every time and I've just not been paying attention. Sometimes they appear lower, like almost within arm's reach. 
I don't know if we'll be so lucky this time. Is this a bit tedious? Well, you know, maybe. Yeah. Don't like the look, like look of that one at all. Poison effect. That one. Uh, let's try now. I've had enough of this. Ah, good. Good. Now, I want you to brace yourself, Jamers, because Uro is lightening her head up, and that's never a good sign. So, it's quite loud in here. In fact, it's so loud, I might just turn it down a smidge because I don't imagine you guys want to be subjected to that. Now, I noticed something a bit strange there. When you pause the game, even if you, the, the window loses focus, or indeed if you open the menu, the music, I uh, use the definition of music there, very loosely stops. I suspect this is because it's being played as like sounds. Um, that's just my non-expert take on it. Sounds like it's saying Ovimto, but trust me, if you spend long enough in here, it sounds like it could be saying anything, really. It's all very distressing. There's a bunch of creatures which seem to be, um, I don't know. They're not happy anyway. Let's not play with that just yet. Well, it's good fun, but not yet. Well, look at this guy. Hmm. Ovento, Ovento. That's the way we came. I mean, it does have a certain groove to it, but it's not really my cup of tea. Much like these guys, I, I feel like I've had my fill. Mm. They don't, uh, they don't completely layer correctly, but you know, nobody's perfect. Nobody is perfect, dreamers. So this area, yeah, as you might be getting a, a vibe for, is a bit of a test of patience. Yeah, look at you. I don't know what was happening there, but I can't imagine it was particularly good. We seem to have arrived after the party, which may be to Uruksuki's benefit. You know what Uruksuki's like? Is that food? It looks like there could be food and sick on the go. Right, well, in, in the hope of trying to save you guys from having to listen to this for much longer, I'm going to try my best to get us to where we want to go, which I think is over here. Good, right, yes. Yes, right. You thought you were free of it there, didn't you? You thought, oh, thank God for that. It's over. No. The torment is never over. I guess these are chopsticks. That is... I'm not even going to say it, Dreamers. It's, it's a portal. It's a portal. What did you think that was? It's a portal. My first tooth. It's a bit bloody still. This takes you into this nice little area. Which is nice and peaceful. It's got stars. It's quite aesthetically pleasing. Hmm. Can't go down there though. Just just to check though, just because I know what this game's like sometimes now. No. It would appear it's under construction if we were to take... It's an odd sign, that one. I don't think I've seen that sign before. Is it a sign of things to come? Yeah, well, maybe. Under construction. I don't know why one of the signs is different. Doesn't he make a lot of sense to me, but... Oh, well. We'll go down here. These DNA... It's like DNA ladders. DNA is just ladders, really. And here's another portal. Doesn't he work though? That's sad. That's alright. 
Uro will not be dissuaded by just one element of the dream world not working. So we just backtrack a wee bit. I like the little sort of flashing stars. It's nice. The whole world's quite nice. The music also makes a refreshing change from what we were just listening to. Reminds me a little bit of a world that I think was taken out. Um, so we've got a, what could be a tooth. Uh, it's in an eye or perhaps a washing machine. Trying to wash out that red. Oh, look, it blinks. Doesn't really do anything now. Just sort of sw swirls around. It's nice though. What does it mean? Well, it doesn't really seem to mean a lot, to be honest. It doesn't seem to mean a lot. Maybe on this. Hmm. It just blinks. That's what it does. Uh, so what we're going to do... Is we're going to bomb properly. None of this half-measure bombing. Oh, come on. We've got places to be. People to see, hearts to break. Because we're going to the heart world. You see what I did there? You see what I did? That was, that was humor. Humor win it. So, even though this, I mean, I've said this loads of times, even though this world isn't that big, I am entirely capable of making this an extremely tedious process getting around here. Um, if we were going to the other world that's in here, uh, we already saw the portal to it, but we're not. This one. We're not going there. Not today, Uro. I know you want to, but not today. We're not going there either. Well, that's, I don't think that is even a, a go anywhere thing. That's a, it's a fact. Back in the day, that would have harbored great excitement for me, but not anymore. The days of effect gathering are long in the past. That is one thing. I wonder, I wonder if they could start adding in new effects. A bit of giggle, wouldn't it? Something to do. I suppose they just want to introduce wallpapers now, don't they? No, we don't want that either. Uh, no, we don't want that either. Oh dear. This is what I was afraid of would happen. I was quite lucky when I was having a wee reconnoiter about that I came across this quite quickly. Of course, I used all my luck up by, by doing that, so that's why you're subjected to the tedium now, dreamers. Oh my god, get lost. Uh, no, no, come on. A brief splash, maybe that will give us some luck. Maybe? Doubt it. But I think the thing is, there's no... There probably is points of reference here, I mean, if you're... If you're actually paying attention and you're not like me, who's just... Expecting to come across these things quickly. But... Um, oh my god, get lost. Uh, I think that's the thing with this world, it doesn't, it doesn't have, like... Well, it doesn't really have anything, it just has heartbeat and red squiggles and stuff. Oh god. And every time I think that we might be about to come across it, I'm like, ah, good, right. This. This is the point of reference that I keep thinking I'm seeing and then I don't. It's like a trip down memory lane again, isn't it, Tremors? Happier times. Simpler times. Get out of my way. I'm going there. Good. And what we want to do is play with this thing. Which I think we will lovingly call screw a butt. Does that sound a bit too suggestive? I'm not inviting. I'm not inviting commentary. It's kind of loud in here, but I'm happy with it being somewhat loud. On brand, Dreamers. Nearly. Thank <laughs> you. 
So we'll see if I text anything to these guys, but we've seen the telephone does. Good riddance, I say. Oh well. A brief respite for a moment. Hi. It's like it's like in the portal, you know. GLaDOS. GLaDOS, you know in the portal? The GLaDOS portal. That's in the game portal, you remember? Narbacular drop. Yes. Go. It's very loud. It seems to be the theme of this fucking episode. Loud as sin. This takes us here. So this is a nice little area. Bear with me on second room, so I just need to do that. Good. So there's a bunch of things to see here. Um, whether or not we're going to see them all in some sort of manageable way, I have no idea because, yeah, it's a maze, dreamers. It's a maze. Um, there's a few things to see. I don't really know how we get between them other than through brute force, so... Um, saddle up, as they say. Saddle up. It's like these little turtles stuck in a little console. How cruel. Uh, yeah, let's go this way, why not? There probably is some sort of system to this, but I... I don't need to tell you, Dreamers, that I'm... I'm hopeless at mazes. Like... It's not even funny how hopeless at mazes I am. Uh, that's the one thing I didn't really want to find, actually. We're not gonna play with that right now. Just remember where we park, Dreamers. That's important. Nah, let's go up. Let's go up. Let's go up. No. Lord knows now, when I'm looking for that, it's going to take us the, the whole rest of the... Ah, right, no. This is good. Right. Now, Dreamers. You know the kind of effects that we normally play with, right? You know. Saws. Uh, maybe the fairy effects on a very peculiar day. Well, I mean, those are good effects and everything, but what if I told you that that is not the tool that we want for this job? Because the tool that we want for this job is this, the Coke can. Yeah, yeah, that's that's what that's what that does. That's what that does. Ah, a portal, do, do you see? Let's do it. Ta-da! Two teeth. Well done, Nero. Changes the music a wee bit. This is some quite nice music. And I think there's more stars. There's blue stars now. Now, I think this is the only stuff that you can do at the moment with this particular gimmick. I don't know that for certain, but... I mean, there's some other colours of stars there, but you can see the they're racing around there, and there's definitely slots for some more in this uh, cosmic game of Trivial Pursuit that we're playing. But now that we've done that, we've had a bit of fun, we've washed our teeth, it's time to go back. It's time to go back, dreamers. We've had too much fun. We've had too much progress. Now it's time for getting lost in that fucking maze again. Who's ready? I'm ready. I'm not ready. I'm not ready. I mean, why? Why this? Why? That effect has never been useful for anything ever. Well, I don't know if that's actually true. I get the feeling that it was used for something like once. Um, and then maybe never again. Oh, that's a dead end. Well, I probably could have figured that one out. So there's at least 
a couple of things I wouldn't mind getting my greasy Uro fingers on. We shall see how well we can do that. Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, let's do that then. Thank you very much, Ken Sir. How very generous of you. Ah, yes. Ah, yes. Well, that looks like a fucking toilet roll. This looks like it could be a toilet roll, or it could be something else. But funnily enough, we have an effect that's a bit like toilet roll. Interesting. Don't even think about it. Don't even fucking think about it. Well, this is cute, isn't it? Maybe this is what lives inside all toilet roll holders. So if you're one of those, you know, people who doesn't believe in toilet roll holders, you just leave your toilet roll sitting on the side. Which is disgusting, by the way, and you shouldn't do that. Disgusting. Um... That's your fate. Right now. Uh, right, okay. Now, there's one other thing that we haven't seen. Are we going to be able to get to it? Um, I'm not going to hold out too much hope. Is it this? No. I'm glad that we found that again so easily so that the next time we actually do want to get to that, we won't be able to. It's easy though, dreamers. It's easy. 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 It's so easy, dreamers. See, there's like little doors and things on whatever video game it says. Uh, yeah. Yeah? Doing amazing, Yumi Tuki again, because I fucking love a good maze, I do. I do love a good maze. At least there's no teleporters in it, though. Ha! Ha! Foreshadowing? Yeah. Maybe. I don't want to play with the toilet roll again. I've had enough toilet roll. Uh, if we don't find it soon, I'll just say it's fine, because... It's not that interesting, really. Yeah, alright, okay, right, let's... Yeah, thanks. I don't think it's over here. It's like I know where I'm going. I don't know where I'm going. Ah! I do know where I'm going. That's what I wanted. Hi! Do I have an effect that lets me climb inside you? If only I did, I tell you what. The phone sounds a bit strange there, but mm. maybe you want music? What cake? Uh, the only effect I can think of that may even be vaguely like what you are looking for, my friend, is this one. Mm. No, I don't even want to try it, to be honest. Oh, I suppose, why not? It is immune to being stopped. Oh well. That um, meeting that everyone was looking forward to, Uro versus the uh, octopus thing, was uh, unfortunately denied. Perhaps we did not have the right effect. Uh, right, okay, no. No, dreamers, no. I think we may have done it in a way that means that this is actually going to be not too tedious. What do you think? Uh, I'm not hopeful, but you never know. Yellow? Ah, oh, the worst game of Trivial Pursuit ever. No, I don't want a dead end. I think we want to go left, maybe? That's where we come in. So we come in, Dreamers. You knew that, didn't you? Uh, 
We're in a maze, streamers. I don't know about you, but I'm fucking terrified. Uh, yeah. Toilet roll again. It's a toilet roll again, dreamers. We found the toilet roll again. All right. Okay. Come on. We 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 found the route. We can remember, can't we? Can't remember. I can't remember anything. I can barely remember what game we're playing half the time. It's uh, it's the one with Uro in it. I think this is where we want to be. Hooray! Excellent. Let's play with this. So this is an interesting little area. Um, very reminiscent of, in fact, I say it's reminiscent. It is using some of the elements of an area that we, again, we haven't been to in a long time. Now, there's a, there's a few things to look at here, uh, but I kind of know where I'm going, so I'm not going to spend too much time just dicking around. Mainly because progress here is, is kind of slow. You can use the bike, of course, which would help, wouldn't it? Now, if we go up here... Kind of know where I'm going. That is a joke, dreamers. That's what we call a joke. Get out of my fucking way, you wee turtle. Come on now, other way. We have, can we, can we like chainsaw this? No. That would be too useful. It does make them go quickly though, which may be to our advantage. Uh, I believe we want to go in uh, this door. Nope, that was the wrong door. See what I mean? It's essentially a teleporter maze. It's just in the two dimensions. It's kind of normally in two dimensions, it's just now it's like vertically. Yeah, this is good. This is good. This is what I want to see. Right, you must be killable, surely. You do have to play a bit of like fucking traffic management here. I wait for these guys to like. He's coming. Wait for these guys to go. Thank you, lads. Huh. It's got this nice little Game Boy thing around it now. Like a Super Game Boy. And then this takes us out here, which is the area you might recall. Um, I don't think it always had this like Game Boy bit around it, but um, I guess it's been given a wee a wee love, a wee bit of love. Um, just to prove that this is the area that you love and remember. God, it, has, it genuinely has been so long since I've been here. Are you new? No, I don't want any thanks. I don't know what you're asking me, but I don't want it. Don't want it. Can we go up to the roof? For old time's sake? Yeah, we can. We certainly can. So there's all sorts to do here. I, I covered this years ago, so uh, I don't think we'll spend too much longer in here. Wake up, Uro. Yes, please. Very good. Very good. Well, that wasn't too painful, was it, dreamers? <sighs> Nothing out of it, though. Nothing. Not a squeak. Um, so that seems like a good opportunity to, say, to speak properly and say, uh, let's save the game. And I will say, uh, actually, hang on, what's this? Oh, it's the music room. No, I don't want the music room. Music room. Out, please. Out, please. Out, please. I'm glad I saved the game. I just want out. I want out. Yeah, thank God. This has been episode 173 of Let's Play Yumi Tookie. Thank you very much for watching, everybody. You've been amazing. Uh, hopefully, I will see you on the next one.